Hi children and how are you? I am Priyanka and let us discuss the following question. It says, it is required to seat five men and four women in a row so that the women occupy the even place. How many such arrangements are possible? Now here we are given... Five men and four women seated in a row. Now, representing place numbers of a row is as follows. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now, we see that even places are 2, 4, 6 and 8. That is 4 places. So women can occupy only these 4 places. So on using theorem 1 of permutation there will be as many number of ways of seating 4 women as permutation of 4 different places taken 4 at a time. So, required number of permutation for women is equal to 4P4. Let it be the first equation. Whereas, 5 men will occupy the 5 odd places. So, required number of permutation is equal to 5 P5 that is the second equation and that is for men. Applying the multiplication principle we get the total number of arrangements of seating five men and four women in a row so that women occupies The even number or even places is equal to equation 1 multiplied by equation 2 that is 4P4 multiplied by 5P5. That is 4 factorial divided by 4 minus 4 factorial multiplied by 5 factorial, 5 minus 5 factorial. That is equal to 4 factorial into 5 factorial. That can be written as 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. That is 24 into 120, 2880. And the required answer is 2880. So this completes, I hope you know the theorem 1 of permutations. Take care.